Hey guys, I'm pretty pumped. We got the piers done the other day and uh, now I've got a break here for a little while and I'm going fishing. I'm actually meeting up with my cousin and uh, right now I just went and got some minnows. We're actually going to go crappie fishing. If you don't know what crappie is, it's uh, I would say it's probably kind of similar to bass. Um, real big here in Oklahoma and this time of year they're actually spawning which is where they come up kind of close to the bank to lay their eggs and they're a little easier to catch. So anyways, we're hoping to uh, to get quite a bit today. I think my cousin had called one of his friends who went last night and I think he had caught quite a few within 30 minutes or an hour or so. Anyways, things are looking good. Uh, it was raining earlier today, but it all cleared up, thank God. A um, little windy, but uh, we should be able to find some breaks from the wind out there. I think we'll be on my cousin's boat as well. And there's the minnows. Not sure if you can make those out or not, but that's what we'll be fishing with. It's what crappie like, at least this time of year. Sometimes you can catch them on jigs. So I'm going to head over to my cousin's and um, hopefully some video of some fish later on. Lake in Oklahoma and uh, kind of made it to the area where we're going to be fishing. It's pretty quiet out here, not a lot of people, so we've got high hopes. Right, Cuss? That's right. All right, so we are fishing for crappie and um, we've only been out here about 10 minutes or so and I just caught this big catfish. I don't know. What do you think this is, Cuss? Five pounds? Yeah. That's pretty big. Not a crappie, by the way. So I got the first fish, and it was a big one. It was a catfish, and uh, I have not caught anything since then. It's been all my cousin. He's the one catching the crappie, one after the other. I'm using the exact same jig as he is, and I have not caught a single one. Um, I don't know what's going on, so I'm going to take a break. And... Uh, let you guys see some action videos of him reeling it in. big one again okay so we've got about 10 or 15 minutes left of fishing it's getting dark here pretty quick we decided to uh, to go back to where my cousin was actually catching quite a bit of crappie um, I've only caught one crappie and one catfish but my cousins figured out a way to use his uh, what's that called panoptic. his pan optic it's like a radar for uh, for underwater he's figured out a way to use that so he found a brush pile and you can actually see all the fish there around the brush pile and he can drop his jig directly kind of where the fish are and see when the fish are close to the jig and anyways it's it's quite interesting I haven't mastered this skill yet <laughs> but he has so I'm gonna show you what he's doing and we'll see if it works again okay so here's the pan optic he's using there's actually kind of a brush pile over here we haven't found the exact spot yet but when he drops his jig in you can kind of see it there um, it shows up and then all of these little bright dots are fish and so you can actually get your jig right close to a fish and uh, kind of attract them and that's what he's been able to do like I said this skill has escaped me so far but uh Apparently he's pretty good at it. All right guys, so we are finishing uh, tonight's adventure and I, for some reason, volunteered to help my cousin clean all these fish. I have no idea what I was thinking. But uh, it's about 10 or 10.30 at night and we're gonna get this complete. So for now, this adventure is done. See you guys next time.